depression is like just a rainy day that doesn't go away. Just thinking about it makes me feel it. That's why I'm emotional. Um, it was scary for a lot of people to hear that she didn't want to be on Earth anymore. We would go through her room and find razor blades, and she would save her bandages with blood on them and tuck them under the bed. In those moments, you feel like nothing's gonna be okay, like, ever. And like, the only way to feel better for me, it was to cut. I was trying to pay for my own sins. For whatever reason, life just wasn't working for her. And that was really hard to see. We were in church. All of a sudden, Pastor came out and he said, hey, we're gonna refocus for a little bit and do this My Hope campaign. As you watch this, I want you to be thinking of the people you know that you wish could see this. I just took that booklet and write down people's names and pray for them every day. Triana's name was on that list. We were invited to our neighbor Joe's. We needed something that was going to be a lightning bolt to Triana's soul. We started the video and Triana was just right there, right in front of the TV, tears streaming down her face. And that night we had three people receive the Lord, Triana, her mom, and another girl. Some of you think that you're too bad to come to God. God's not waiting to judge you. He will take you and forgive you and love you and be your friend. In the pamphlet, there is a, a prayer to reach out to him, and I just felt him in my heart, like, here's all my struggles, trusting him with my life. Good morning, church family. This is Triana Riddle. I accepted Jesus as my savior for watching the Billy Graham My Hope video on December 6th. It's my honor to baptize you in the name of the Father, the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. It's a new life. And it's my new life, and I wanted people to know about it. I mean, I still have struggles with depression. I don't cut at all anymore. <laughs> Jesus bled for me so I didn't have to. Yeah. One Sunday, God spoke to me through Billy Graham's video, My Hope. And after having watched the Billy Graham, My Hope video, I truly understood the consequences of being unrepentant. I called out to God to save me. It was then I knew I wanted to give my life to Jesus Christ, our Lord and Savior. A lot of God's people have never been challenged to step out into the unknown, which is the way we're supposed to live life. This is a great opportunity for people to feel really comfortable about bringing their friends to the gospel. Another video on the horizon would give me the opportunity to try to develop relationship with other people and reach out to them. I would say, okay, I'm having a movie night. I want you to come. Who knows what will happen? And I just feel like God says, that's not up to you. The outcome of what happens isn't, isn't your responsibility. I've just asked you to invite people and let, leave the rest to me. When I saw this the first time, what I thought was, man, I hope this isn't the only one. I hope we're gonna be able to do this some more. I'll do it every year in my church because I believe the power of God's on it and I think the Spirit of God wants to use this. And in the future, I think it's going to be one of the ways God uses to tell the story. <laughs>